is your neighborhood friendly ranter speaking and I am bringing you another edition of the best movies you've never heard of. This time it's a very little known movie called Bickford Schmeckler's Cool Ideas. Now this is a movie I originally saw for free on Comcast On Demand and I w what really stuck out to me, of course, was the title, Bickford Schmeckler's Cool Ideas. Just a really odd title. Uh, seemed like one of those very low-budget independent films that I may be able to get into, and it really was. It has very relatable characters, uh, especially Bickford Schmeckler. And the basic plot line is, Bickford Schmeckler is a college student who has been basically devoting his life to this book of really cool ideas that explain the universe and explain basically how everything works. And one day at a college party at his house that he's renting with his best friend, this woman played by the beautiful Olivia Wilde, uh, she basically just shows up and throws his world into chaos because she infiltrates his room and she finds this book and reads it and really likes it and she steals it basically and goes home and it's the story of him trying to get this book back that is ba basically his life um, he's a very misanthropic character and doesn't really like attention or any of that kind of stuff He's just basically in it for this book that he's been writing for basically his whole entire college career and everything he's ever done has been put into this book. And eventually, you know, some very comical, uh, cultish type things ensue and this very almost uh, dude where's my car uh, situations kind of happen to him. Only this is way funnier. This is just a genuinely charming and funny movie. Uh, especially if you're like me and you're misanthropic, uh, you relate to Bickford Schmeckler quite a bit. So, my recommendation is go out and find this movie. Uh, it's probably going to be very cheap. It's a very cheap movie. I bought it for one cent on Amazon, uh, and a total of about maybe three or four bucks at the most. That's including shipping. Uh, so I probably paid about three bucks for it. Um, shipping and cost so go out and buy it it's a really good movie to watch uh, and it's really fun so that's my recommendation